What is going on guys, I'm your boy Sunny and today I'm back bringing you another episode of Sunny on Sunday as we are slowly but surely creeping up to that episode 50 which is actually insane to me because it is still the longest running thing on my channel it's the one thing that I have actually stuck to uploading despite how inconsistent it has been at points but I've been keeping it up pretty consistently for the past like month, month and a half or something since the new year and before I believe, let me quickly just check um, because what what I like about my channel at the moment is it has a really nice symmetry to it if you actually go onto it and look at it. Like, um, my Sunny on Sundays are all basically in the same row of my video uploads, and same thing with my TFRs. It depends if I've uploaded like one or two videos during the week that has changed that, but the consistency is still there. I'm really enjoying like YouTube again, I'm really enjoying doing what I'm doing, but it's still insane to think that it's nearly like episode 50. We're on episode, this will be 44, and like I said, if you look at my channel, you can see there's like the symmetry of the consistency every week, and it's just mind-blowing, but yeah, this week hasn't been pretty insane, I haven't done a hell of a lot, um, just been sticking to college, sticking to my schoolwork, getting it all done, sorted, so that I have nothing to worry about come May, um, what else? I still haven't heard back from my final uni yet. I do have my uni open days planned and stuff for the ones I have offers from. Um, so on the 5th of March, I'm going to an applicant day in Lincoln, which should be awesome because if any of you guys know Tom Scar, the YouTuber, he did the same course that I want to do at uni, I believe. Or one very similar anyway, but the University of Lincoln is very well known for its like media. It's very well known for its film courses, and that's why I chose that as one of my options. It isn't the hardest university to get into by any means, but... Just the fact that it's specifically what I want to do is film related and it perfectly highlights and complements that. So what the open day or the applicant day will do is show me around the campus, show me around the accommodation and things like that. From the ones I've seen so far, um, well it's only Coventry I've been to to be honest. I've been to Royal Holloway because it's literally down the road for me but at the moment that practically isn't an option just because... I don't want to live that close to my uni, I literally want to move out and if I went to Royal Holloway which is like I said down the road, I wouldn't bother moving out. So that's one of the things that draws me away from that um, and still waiting from York, um, hopefully they'll get back to me within the next week, two weeks and then I'll have an interview potentially and then I, because that's still where I want to go, that's still my main choice for a uni. Just because the accommodation there is awesome, the course looks amazing. Marolan, as you guys may remember, and my friend Nick, he is currently there studying it, and that's why he stopped his YouTube channel. My posters are falling down, fantastic. And with, we want to do the same course, the one he's currently doing, he's loving it. So that's why I want, or not, I don't want to go because of him. I want to go to York because it is like a really good uni to get into, a really good course, and like I said, it would be so nice to actually move out for uni, but yeah. Other than that, university-wise, I'm not too fussed. I'm literally just waiting for this one offer. Everything else is sorted. Um, it's just a case of now getting the grades I need to get into the unis and make sure I get all my work done by the time it needs to be done. So, yeah. In terms of YouTube, I've been consistent. In terms of schoolwork, I've been keeping on top of it all, getting it all done and sorted and literally giving myself nothing to stress about this year because I came into this year wanting positive vibes, feeling positive, wanting to sort basically everything out, just sort myself out, give myself a massive slap around the face just to get my shit together and get shit done and hopefully come September, October time I'll be at university, I'll be sorted and I'll be in a position to enjoy a course for the next four years after dealing with two years of this IT work that has just been draining the life out of me but yeah, other than that everything's pretty positive, pretty normal um, I got my job back, I had my interview for Thought Park yesterday, um, and they basically, I was, in my own personal opinion, I was the most confident in the group interview, I knew what I was going to do, because it was the exact same format as last year, so I went in, I did that, and everyone else was pretty nervous, pretty unconfident, and I think it, like, showed in leaps and bounds that I knew what I was doing, just because everyone who was interviewing us knew me from last year, they knew what I was like as a person, and, um, they basically offered me a job before doing the one-on-one -on -one interviews again, so that was awesome, that was perfect. So a month from now, a month and two weeks from now, I will be rehired, I will be re-employed again. So I'll finally be able to start making money, 
and then with that I can pay my girlfriend back, I can save up to buy a new PC for uni, which means I can give you so much better content once I actually start university, because unlike Marola and I do plan on keeping it of my YouTube, because I'm back at a stage now where I'm enjoying it that much that I really, really don't want to waste like two years of hard work by just stopping my channel completely, so yeah, Whew. that was all like one or two breaths. That was pretty hard to do. I don't know why I do that, um, but yeah, so that is the plan. Once I have my job again, my main priority is paying my girlfriend back because I do owe her, owe her like a shit ton of money, but yeah. Um, we're still good, we're still happy, we're not going away this year as far as I'm aware because I really just want to save all of my money as opposed to spending it on holidays and stuff. Um, so what I plan on doing is just taking all of my money out in cash, keeping the stuff I need for like contracts and Netflix and shit like that, the necessities that I'll need in my main bank account and then moving all of the rest of it into a separate bank account that I'll use to literally just save for university stuff. So that's my plan. Um, hopefully I can stick to it, fingers crossed I can, because now I've said it in a video, I really don't want to go back on it, because I have said to everyone basically, I'm just saving for a PC, and that's really what I want to stick to doing, that's really what I want to do, because I just need a better PC, I literally have everything else set in terms of what I need to do for YouTube, I just need a better PC, better internet, and then I'm literally set, I can just smash it from there, so... That's the aim, that's what I plan on doing, and that's another reason I want to move out for uni, just so I can get better internet, because I can't keep living with this talk talk bullshit that takes like three hours to upload a five minute video, so yeah, hope you guys have enjoyed, as always I've been your boy Sully, apologies this has been a bit like a mishmash of everything, but this is sort of what this series is about, it's just talking to you guys, letting you guys know straight what current situation I'm in, where I'm at, what I'm doing, and yeah. So that's it, you can expect to see the normal things next week, TFR on Monday, and then a different video during the week. I may upload some Battlefront, because I haven't done that in like a while, but yeah, that's potentially what I'm going to do. TFR, selling on Sundays, on Sundays, I might upload four next week actually, just because I really want to start getting more content out, because it seems like I like the consistency, like I said, but it would be nice to get something a little bit different out there. I did an early rant last week. That didn't actually go down as well as I thought I did. It has decent numbers of views, but like the most dislikes I've had in a video in a long time. So, yeah, that was a little bit weird, but my sports watch just randomly turned on. How bloody strange. Alright, that's been off for like a week and it's turned on randomly, but yeah. Hope you guys have enjoyed. As always, I've been your boy Sully. This has been Sully on Sunday, episode 44. Hope you guys have enjoyed, like I said, if you have then do be sure to leave a like, give me comments, let me know what you want to see on the channel, if there is anything different you'd like, and yeah, that is that. Hope you guys enjoyed, like I said, like, comment, subscribe, and peace.